Welcome to math we know. We're given that f of x is equal to x cubed then times bracket of a times 2 to the power x then minus 2 to the power minus x. It's an even function. So f of x is equal to this and it's an even function. So the value of a. This question is very, very easy. If f of x is an even function, and then we can get f of x is equal to f of minus x. And we can solve it. So if f of x is an even function, and then f of x is equal to f of minus x. So f of x is equal to this. It's x cubed, then times bracket of a times 2 to the power x, then minus 2 to the power minus x. And then it is equal to all of the x are written as minus x. So it's minus x, then cube, and then times a times 2 to the power what? Minus x, and then minus 2 to the power minus minus x is 2 to the power x. Awesome. Then, because here, okay, wait, write it again x cubed then times a bracket of a times 2 to the power x and then minus 2 to the power minus x and then equals it is equal to minus x then cube is minus x cubed and then times a times 2 to the power minus x minus 2 to the power x here x cubed and here also x cubed and then they can ask out each other and and then here a times 2 to the power x the minus 2 to the power minus x. It is equal to, here is a minus, so it is minus a times 2 to the power x minus x, and then minus, here is minus, so it's plus. Minus minus is equal to plus, and then plus 2 to the power x. Move the term on the right side to the left side, and it is a times 2 to the power x, and then minus 2 to the power x, and then what plus a times to the power minus x and then minus to the power minus x it is equal to zero and now we can factorize it because here a minus one and then times to the power x and then plus a minus one times to the power minus x is equal to zero so this is a minus 1 and then times 2 to the power x and then plus 2 to the power minus x is equal to 0. So the power x is positive and 2 to the power minus x is also positive. Positive plus positive, so it is positive. But here a minus 1 and then times a positive term is equal to 0. So we can get a minus 1 is equal to 0. a minus 1 is 0. So a is equal to 1. And don't forget what? Yes! Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and ring the bell. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.